What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Online. I just want to make a quick video letting you all know tomorrow, July the 9th at 3 p.m. Eastern, you can tune in to Twitch TV slash Bethesda for the first live look at the upcoming quarter three DLC release and info about update 27. Of course, there will be some developers there talking about, you know, quarter three what they're going to bring to the game, how this is going to fit into the setting of the you know year-long Dark Heart of Skyrim theme. Also, Twitch drops will be enabled, so make sure you link your account. And they will also be talking about uh, the public test server on PC, There's some information about it and when it's going to be going live for this next update. Now, I think a lot of people, including myself, think this is pretty quick considering Greymore just was released. But Greymore was delayed a little bit, so that may be why it feels so quick for all this information to be coming out already. And I know they have to kind of stay on, uh, you know, stay on task because they have, you know, quarter three and quarter four DLC to release before the end of the year. And I know working from home and, and trying to get these updates and stuff out is pretty taxing, I'm sure, on a lot of these developers. So I'm interested. I'm interested to see what quarter three will bring. I'm definitely interested to see what update 27 is going to bring. I know a lot of people have a lot of opinions on some of the uh, gear that you can get from doing antiquity, some of the you know mythic items being too strong, too weak, whatever the case may be. There's still some things in game that I feel is going to get changed eventually. Uh, one thing is bloodthirsty on your jewelry. I think it's eventually going to get nerfed. I, I just feel with some of the things that have been added, some of the update and changes that have been made, that bloodthirsty is a bit strong. Uh, I, I think... Just in general, everybody is starting to see that with max CP and, and new gear and new mythic items and all the stuff that has been added into the game over the last year or so, it, it looks like some stuff is going to have to be toned down, some stuff's going to have to be buffed up. It's going to kind of depend. I really don't like all the changes that they make personally because it seems like from update to update, month to month, every couple months, you're having to change your, change your skills, change your gear change your uh, you know whatever's rolled onto your gear whatever the case may be i know that gets frustrating really if you're a new player it gets very frustrating if you don't have the you know the skill points if you don't have the gold i know that's kind of frustrating for players that have played for a long time it's just frustrating in general to have to redo all your stuff over and over uh, for content creators i know it's frustrating as well but that's kind of the world you live in when you have uh, have a game that's kind of ever evolving and something that's been out for a long time they have to change things up to a point to keep the game kind of fresh and interesting and give people things to do. So I am interested to see what this new quarter three update will bring, what the new update 27 will bring to the kind of game in general. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you're a PC player, uh, leave me a comment where, with your thoughts about a you know, public test server kind of coming this quickly after Graymore. If you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do. Make sure you click the bell icon up in the top right corner so you can get notified when all my videos go live. Of course, if you have a chance to share the video, it does help out the channel a lot. And be sure to check out the affiliate here on the channel, GT Racing. All their information is linked down in the description. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.